Shoulder Rest Isni for violin and viola, developed, made and manufactured by Wittner in Germany. Assembly instructions. Option B. Assembly with centered Wittner chin rest. First of all, please make yourself familiar with the content of the package. There are two tender hooks, the shoulder rest space, the shoulder rest arm with the pad, a hex wrench to adjust the ball joints at the rest's arm, optional a cross tip screwdriver, two crosshead Phillips screws, a cloth bag to store your shoulder rest safely in your case, and a setting template. If there is already a centered Wittner chin rest installed on your instrument, please remove it completely. Therefore, you unscrew the two screws of the tender hooks with the Phillips screwdriver. Then you assemble the shoulder rest space instead of the two tender hooks by using the two crosshead screws. Only turn the screws with the screwdriver on both sides about three times. After that you place the whole system loosely centered on your instrument and fix it by screwing alternately left and right until the system is really tight. Now you place the free end of the shoulder rest's arm into the receiver at the base and turn it clockwise as far as possible, approximately one eighth turn to the right. Then latch the shoulder rest arm with the lever by rotating the lever clockwise. When you hear a click, your shoulder rest is safely latched. Then you open the ball joint screw with the hex wrench. You can move the shoulder rest's arm horizontal and vertical to your favorite position. There is another ball joint behind the pad. You can reach it through the centered hole in the pad and can also move the pad itself in any direction after you have opened the screw. You can easier reach the second ball joint by removing the pad from the shoulder rest's arm. Just remove the pad with the hand out of its ball joints where it is locked together with the shoulder rest arm. If the pad needs to be cleaned, you can hand wash it with warm water. Just be sure to dry it completely before reassembling. Without the pad, it is very easy to reach the second ball joint with a hex wrench. If you wish, you can use the setting template to fine tune the positioning of the shoulder rest's arm. Just place it as seen over the arm and mark the position of the shoulder rest on each scale. You can easily find back to your last position and can probably find your favorite final position faster with the template. If you found your personal perfect final position, please tighten the screws of the ball joints, but pay attention not to damage them. Now you never have to readjust your Isni shoulder rest, it will stay in the position where you have fixed it. To disassemble the shoulder rest for transport, remove the pad rest by opening the lever and then turning the pad rest counterclockwise and lifting it out of the receiver. The little gel ball at the end of the shoulder rest's arm should never touch the body of your instrument. Here you see that it touches the base of this strongly arched viola. That doesn't affect the sound of the instrument, but it cannot be guaranteed that there will be no marking in the varnish after a longer period of stronger pressure. If necessary, we recommend to install a thicker piece of cork at the shoulder rest's base. To reach the smallest size for transport, you can dismantle the shoulder rest by using the small lever at the pad. To open it, push it to the right and release the shoulder rest's arm counterclockwise out of the receiver. You can stow both parts in the cloth bag and store it safely 
inside your instrument's case. To reassemble the shoulder rest, you follow the last instructions in reverse. Have fun with your ultralight and anti-allergic shoulder rest ISNI by Wittner, which is 100% made in Germany. You will experience that your instrument will have a richer and clearer sound and that your shoulder rest is extremely comfortable to play. Even for musicians that had chronic pain problems in the past playing their instruments. For further information, please visit our website at www.wittner.com. Hyphen gmbh dot de.